to my channel so if you're new here thank you so much for stopping by if you just came back thank you so much for the support i really appreciate it so in today's video i'm going to show you another simple recipe i'm going to show you how to make sausage buns so stay tuned and let's see how this comes out the ingredients for today are three farmer's choice smokies you can use sausages but this is what i found so this is what i'm going to use for this recipe any can do so just use anything that is sausagey so next we have one egg this is salt and sugar to taste you can add different spices if you want you can add cayenne pepper you can add black pepper just as you wish but today I'm just going to use uh, sugar and salt to taste just a little then I have toothpicks we're going to see what those are for in a bit I have my rack here I really love this rack this is for placing the sausage rolls after sausage buns sorry sausage buns after frying them so here i have uh, about three tablespoons of self-raising flour i really love self-raising flour because i do not know how to proportion uh, how to add baking powder baking soda to flour so i prefer using the ready-made that comes in a uh, purple packet x flour uh, self-raising flour so next i have milk we're not going to use water for this recipe so we're going to use milk you can use any type of milk this is straight from the cow because we live in a village setup area and then i have more flour for dipping before we dip into the butter so let's get on to this so in a separate not a separate in a chopping board you're going to pick your smokies place them like that like that I'm only going to use three you can use more depending on the size of your family so you're going to place your sausages like that and then you're going to go in with a knife this is what you're going to want to do cut them like that not too small not too thick just about this is about um an inch or an inch and a half thick like that And that's what you'll have so as you can see these are around how many pieces 12 pieces so i'm going to put these small pieces aside i'm only going to use these big pieces this can be a very good snack if you have kids around but you can also snack on it you can make make these for your birthdays and your little cocktail events so after that you're gonna this is where the toothpick comes in you take one toothpick like this you can see pick one toothpick like that and put it inside one bun like that one sausage roll like that and place it aside pick the next toothpick place it inside like that so i'm gonna do the rest and then I'm gonna I'm gonna come back with the rest of them done with the next step. So place your smokies aside and get your flour. This is plain flour, as I said. This is self-raising flour. Um, I'm going to add in my sugar and salt. As I said, you can add all the all the different spices if you wish. You can add cayenne pepper and black pepper. So I'm gonna add that to that like that. Give it a good mix so that everything gets well incorporated like that then after that you want to crack in one egg and mix it until it's well incorporated as well Oops. you can use a bigger bowl if you don't want to get a mess so that's how you do it if your mixture gets this sticky you're going to add very little milk so that you can get a good butter so here's the milk i'm just going to add very little not too much kidogo san you might want to change the spoon if you're using a uh, 
plastic one like mine because it's going to mess you up. So I'm just gonna use this. You need to mix it into a little liquidy paste. So you add milk whenever you need until it becomes like, not like pancake butter, but something close. So I'm going to add more. So I added more milk and the butter turned out like this. So this is what you want to get. Not too soft and not too thick. Not too what? Not too soft or what? Not too smooth and not too thick. So that's it. So I'm gonna put that aside and show you the next step. The next step this is where the flour comes in. So you're going to pick your smoky sausage or whatever you're using and dip it into flour like that. The flour will help you get the coating, coat the sausages with butter well, better. Put them aside like that. Just be patient like that. Put them aside. I'm going to do all of them and then I'm going to come back with the next. So I am done. This is how they look like. So let me go and get the oil ready and then we start frying. So you're going to heat your oil on medium heat, on medium flame, sorry. Don't put too much. Just about enough, and then let it heat up. The oil is ready, so you're going to dip one piece into the butter don't overcoat it like that and then you put it in the oil you see it's going to start sizzling immediately pick the next one dip it in just coat it slightly like that and dip it in as well so I wish you could smell it from here. It smells, they smell so good. I think it's because of the eggs. Make sure they are brown, well brown enough, like this. So we are going to get them out of the fire, the oil. You see how they look like? And then you put them, set them aside on a kitchen towel. Like that. Go in with the rest of the of the sausages. So guys, this is the final product. So I'm going to bite into one so that you can see the inside. That's how it looks like inside. And it's so tasty. So please try it out and tell me how it turns out. If you haven't subscribed, please remember to subscribe and hit the bell notification button. And stay tuned for the next, just coming right now, I have a next video for you guys. Thank you.